We'll take one more hit over there at Bastion's place. And just give it a slow, even retrieve. And we got one. How big is it? Oh yeah, there's a seven pounder. Yes sir, that's all of seven right there. Hey, welcome back to another video everybody here at l &M Lake and Golf Retreat. Today it's about, uh, it's about 4.30 and I'm gonna fish for about an hour down there. I'm gonna go on Amen Corner and I'm gonna throw this six cents swim bait or glide bait or whatever you wanna call it. It's about four inches long. I'm gonna try to catch a couple of bass and see what happens. I just got down here from Weatherford, uh, had a dental appointment, but I left early this morning about 4.30, 5 o'clock in the morning to go down there. But I came by the lake uh, to pick up some sand to get the tamper, rakes, all that kind of stuff. As you guys can see, we're putting a irrigation system in our backyard in Odessa. Check this out. Not welcome to another episode. This is a work day. Putting an irrigation system in our backyard. Went and got the trencher yesterday, trenched all the lines. There's the manifold. Here's the box we're gonna put it in. Wires coming up. Orbit, got six sprinklers here. Manifold's gonna go there. So you see people, it's not all fun and games at l and Lake and Golf Retreat, but this is in Odessa. It's our yard, it's our new pool we just put in. We trenched all this yesterday and we've laid zone one and zone two. Zone two stops right here. Zone three goes over there. This is the Tiff Tough grass that we got from the farm. Give you a little insight into my normal life. And we also got four pallets of Tiff Tough sod. And here's the sod on the other side of the fence. See if I can, I don't know if y'all can see that. What do you think, boss? We're getting there. We're getting there? I was gonna show them before and after. Check you guys on the flip side. So, as you can see, we're laying the pipe down, we're getting the sprinklers all ready, and by the time I get back Friday afternoon, we should have sawed down and sprinklers running. So hopefully I can catch a couple of good bass to keep you guys company. So join me down at Amen Corner, let's see if we can go land a couple of eight pound bass, right? Always catch eight pound bass. Well, hopefully I can say that today. So let's go down there, take this swim bait, wait out there about two and a half feet, see what we can get. Let's get down there and catch a couple of fish. All right, let's see what we got here. Looks like a glide bait, so let's just glide it a little bit and see what happens. A little goop on it, what is that? Slime goop. better. There's one. That feels pretty good. That feels pretty good, ladies and gentlemen. It is good. It's about a five pounder. Hey girl, I always catch five pound bass. Come on, sweetheart. There you go. She's all the six pounds. Yes, sir. Beautiful bass. Gotta get my fires out of here. Right there. We're gonna get her undone. How about that? Sorry, sweetheart. All right, there's one. Oh, she's all six pounds. Well, welcome to L&M Lake and Golf Retreat. Beautiful bass. She's been out for a little over a minute. But I think she's going to be just fine. Right there she goes. She gone. Six cents glide bait or swim bait or I don't know what you call it. I'm not much of a connoisseur on that stuff. Oh, 
I missed that one. We'll take one more hit over there at Bastion's place. And just give it a slow, even retrieve. And we got one. How big is it? Feels pretty good. Might as well work our way back to the bank, right? Oh yeah, there's a seven pounder. Oh yeah, it's good bass. Come on up here. Yes sir, that's all of seven right there. Maybe even eight. Oh, she's eight. Always catch eight pound bass. How about that? That's an eight pounder right there. That's an eight pounder all day long. Eight pound bass. Isn't she beautiful? Oh my goodness, look at that. And people, I don't have to weigh them. I've weighed them enough. I can tell you that's every bit of eight pounds. I always catch eight pound bass. Look at that girl. Beautiful, the old tail's going. She's beautiful. All right, baby. She gone. What is the first rule in fishing, ladies and gentlemen? Do not leave bass to find bass. So let's just go right back out there again and catch one more. See how long we've been fishing. I've been fishing for 30 minutes. You do not leave bass to find bass. There she went. I always catch eight pound bass. All right, a six and an eight. I'm kind of liking that. Do we have any phrase in that line? None whatsoever. Hit it, but I missed her. Dang it. That's a good little thump right there. Good little thump. We're going to give her another try. Oh, I had another hit right there. I know where they're at. Man, they're rolling like crazy over there. I might have to go down, down there and try it. That's, I've seen four or five right over there. We might have to try that over there. Just walk down there, throw about two or three times. See what I can come up with. Let's try it. All right. All right. I'll meet you guys right down there. All right, we're gonna walk right out here. About 30 yards. We're gonna hit that hump. There went a bass right there. Ooh, this water's, well, it's not warm, warm, but. Here we go, see if we can scare something up. Ah. See if we can scare something up out here. This is really muddy. Surprised I haven't stepped on a big old catfish yet. Okay, y'all ready? Let's try it. I don't know what that is, but I got it. It's a bass. It looks like a little 
four, three and a half. Oh yeah. Three and a half, four. Come on, girl. Come on up. Yep, she's four pounds. Three and a half. Get you out of that mud. Beautiful fish. Let's get it out of your eye there. Now we'll get it out of your lip. Oh yeah, she's four pounds. She's fat and heavy. Fat and heavy. Let's get you cleaned off. Show you to the people. Yeah, she's a three and a half. Little fat belly. Three and a half, four pounds. All right, let's go over. She gone. All right, people. How about that? Take a look at this swim bait. Six cents, right? Isn't that what that is, six cents? Yeah, a little shad swim bait. She works good. All right, we got it all done. Covered it up. Still got to put pea gravel on that. Yep, it's all counted correctly. This is the new side. It's a beautiful Mrs. Letson. And her work shirt. Guggen Squad work shirt. Laura and the boys actually laid about 90% of this yesterday while I was coming back. This is the other side of the sprinkler system. That's zone three going on. So that's it. Back to the fishing, back to the eight pounders, back to the six pounders, back to the big Mondo bass. Hey, what's up everybody? We got her done. We got her done. A six, a eight, and a four. And uh, didn't get anything off the point, but man, I always catch an eight pound bass, right? Uh, I didn't have no scale, but trust me, I've seen enough eight pounders down here that that was a trophy bass, that was eight pounds. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you like this content, smash the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share the video. Love you guys. God bless. And L&M will always have eight pound bass, baby. Love you guys. See you later. Bye.